Hello everybody, it is Mike Less. I am out here at Uhas Brothers Farms in Orwell, Ohio. Also home of Colebrook Elevator. It is the second week of May and there is a lot going on at this farm today. I was up here on their versatile 550 tractor and they had some other equipment out running in the field and I had a little time so I got some video of uh, some other tractors going here but we're going to start out with the versatile 550 out in the field pulling a sunflower field cultivator with a brilliant cultipacker behind that. Orwell, Ohio is located in Ashtabula County, Ohio, which is the northeasternmost county in the state of Ohio. It is also the largest county land-wise in the state of Ohio. It is best known for having 19 covered bridges in this county and also has the longest and the shortest covered bridges in the United States. I did a video at this farm a few years ago of the Versatile 550 just behind the grain bins in... Uh, that was all I got from the farm. So uh, in this video today, of course, we got this tractor here. We also got one of their uh, Challenger tractors pulling a Great Plains soil finisher with a brilliant packer behind that. And a New Holland T8 tractor pulling a 60-foot Great Plains grain drill planting soybeans. They were also going to start planting corn today, but I could not stick around and get any footage of that. Soil up here in Ashtabula County is pretty tight and does not drain real well. You will see some wet spots in the fields here throughout the video. And as many farmers here will tell you, uh, if you wait for absolute perfect soil conditions to get your farming done, you'll never get in the field. I am also told that they have to put a drain towel every 20 feet in these fields to get proper drainage. This part of Ohio prior receives the most snow in the state of Ohio too, as this is just the tip of the snow belt for the Great Lakes off of Lake Erie. Uhas Brothers grows corn, soybeans, some wheat, and also some peas, and I am going to try to get back up here later in the summer when they are combining peas. I grew up not terribly far from this area, so I've known these guys or known of these guys for a long time. They used to buy a lot of uh, farm equipment at the dealer I used to work at down at Whitmer's Incorporated. They had some white tractors up here back in the day farm is not necessarily loyal to any brand of equipment you will see all makes and models of tractors and equipment out on this farm Alright, now I am out in another field with uh, one of their Challenger 865C tractors pulling the Great Plains Soil Finisher and another brilliant uh, packer.
Okay, and here is some video of one of their new Holland T8 tractors pulling a Great Plains grain drill. I believe they told me this was 60 foot wide. I'm sure some of you, you that know Great Plains equipment better than I do can look at this and tell me how wide this is. But they are planting soybeans here. <laughs> 